What's going on guys? And today we're going to be reviewing the LEGO Star Wars Imperial Shuttle set at 75302. It has 660 pieces and it retailed for 70 US dollars. This set is incredible. The minifigure selection is kind of weak, but other than that, the set is just fantastic. And this is my first Imperial Shuttle. I'm, ex I'm super excited to add this to my collection. And before we get into the minifigures, let's take a look at the shuttle. So the wings do fold downward all the way to where they look like that. But other than that, they just fall over. So you got to put them back upwards and this comes off pretty easily. So you definitely got to uh, be careful with that. Like there. And... Yeah, there are two guns on the sides right there. This part opens up like this. I don't know how I feel about that, but it's fine. You can put two minifigure or a a minifigure right there. There is no hatch to get inside the ship, which that's a big bummer. Um, but there are two stud shooters on the sides, and yeah, I mean that's really it for the. Set. I mean, there's an engine in the back. That's what it looks like from the back. It's got two Technic pieces to hold it as a stand. And yeah, that's really it for the Imperial Shuttle. Really detailed. The play features are lacking. Other than that, though, it just looks cool on display. And I'm really happy to have one in my collection. And they're really expensive to get. So having one's really cool. Now let's get into the minifigures. Let's get into the Imperial Officer. He is just a standard Imperial officer. He comes with a pistol, standard Imperial officer hat, no new face prints with the microphone and the uh, uh, angry empire or like the Sears empire look. The basic torso print with the belt, uh, some leg printing. There's some bag printing, no arm printing, no back leg printing, and got this uh, standard skin tone look. And that's really for the Imperial officer. Now let's get into Luke. Luke Skywalker comes with his green lightsaber. He has a Jedi outfit. He has handcuffs, which I'm guessing Luke is handcuffed in the set. Um, he comes with no leg printing, which that kind of stinks. Uh, some torso print. He's got some back uh, torso print. He's got the flesh-colored uh, hand. He's got the black hand as his robotic hand. He's got a uh, like a lightish tan um, hairpiece with like a little bit of brown so it's really nice he comes with two face prints that face and a serious face or it's just smiling that's really cool now the honestly they did a really good job updating him Darth Vader Darth Vader is really cool he sadly does not have arm printing which oh, I don't know why they took that out in the set which that sucks but he comes with his uh, new face print which I really like that face print he comes with his red lightsaber. He has really nice leg printing. He's got really nice torso printing. He does have a little bit of back printing, which you don't really see that with the guys with the capes. They normally just leave that out. And yeah, and it's really it. He comes with his new helmet, and that's really it. All right, if, if you guys are asking if I recommend this set, 100%. This set will look epic on display. I really like how it looks. And this set just looks awesome. And it's fairly sized, too. I mean, that compared to my hand, that's a pretty decent set. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Just click the button down below. And subscribe. Subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.